Hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'll show you how to create an AI-powered chatbot that can answer questions about your company policies in seconds using N810, Google Drive, and Gemini AI. Imagine never having to search through long policy documents or wait for HR to reply to common questions. This solution works for all your company policies, HR, IT, security, or any other department. So, what are we building? We're creating a chatbot that instantly finds the right answers from your official documents, no matter how big they are. It saves time for everyone, employees, managers, and HR. And because it reads your real documents, the answers are always accurate and up to date. Let's dive into how this works behind the scenes. Here's the step-by-step -step workflow we'll set up in NA10, Google Drive Trigger. We start with Google Drive. Every time you upload, edit, or update a policy document, whether it's HR, IT, or anything else, N8N detects the change automatically. Download document. Next, N8N downloads the latest version of the document, so the chatbot always works with the newest information. Document passing. The document is then converted to plain text, so the AI can read and understand the content, even if it was a PDF, DOCX, or Google Doc. Text chunking. The large document is split into smaller, manageable chunks or sections. This helps the AI give precise answers by focusing only on the most relevant parts. Embeddings with Gemini AI. Each chunk is sent to Gemini AI to create embeddings. These are smart summaries that help the AI search for meaning, not just keywords. Store in Pinecone. All these embeddings are stored in Pinecone, a vector database. This lets the chatbot search instantly and accurately, even with lots of documents. User question. When someone asks a question, like, which devices are allowed at work, N8N sends the question to Gemini AI to generate an embedding for it too. Semantic search. The workflow uses Pinecone to find the most relevant document chunks matching the user's question. Answer, generation. Gemini AI reads those top chunks and generates a clear, direct answer often quoting the original policy, so you always know where the information came from. Reply to user. The chatbot sends the answer back to the user in the chat interface or your chosen platform. Let's see how this works in real life. For today's demo, I've uploaded a BYOD policy for our sample company, ABC Test, to Google Drive. Now, I'll ask the chatbot, what devices are allowed at the workplace in company ABC Test? In just a few seconds, the chatbot finds the answer and shares the policy details. No need to scroll or search manually. You can use this same approach for any policy. Leave policy, expense rules, IT guidelines, security procedures, whatever your company needs. Why is this so powerful? Answers are instant. No waiting for HR. The solution supports any number of policies for any department. Every update in Google Drive is automatically included no manual syncing needed. Employees always get the latest and most accurate answers. Let me quickly show you how to set this up. Connect your Google Drive account in N8N. Set up a trigger for file updates or uploads in your policies folder. Add a step to download the document when a change is detected. Use a document parser node to extract the text. Split the text into chunks using a text splitter node. For each chunk, call the Gemini AI node to create embeddings. Save these embeddings in Pinecone. Set up a webhook or chat agent node to receive questions from users. When a question is received, create its embedding with Gemini AI. Search Pinecone for the closest matching chunks. Use Gemini AI to generate a natural language answer. Return the answer to the user on your intranet, Slack, Microsoft Teams, or any chat platform you like. And that's it. You now have a powerful, scalable, AI-powered chatbot that can answer any policy question for your company, fully automated and always up to date. If you found this useful, please like and subscribe. Got questions or want to see another use case? Drop a comment below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.